Hey kids, Chaplain Zarzana here, and I am going to take you through how to put together your pinwheel if you received one at the Easter egg hunt. The first thing you're going to want to do is take a look at your items that you received at the Easter egg hunt. There should have been four that you received. One is this little straw that you could use to drink out of if you didn't use it for your pinwheel. Another piece is a little handle that's going to fit into the straw. This item, I don't know what we would call it, right? You ever look at something that's like, we'll call it laminated paper, right? It's the closest thing to it, it's so shiny, right? And this is the fun part, right, of the pinwheel. And then we also have this really small piece, right? This little tip. It's gonna help us to finish our pinwheel once we've put it together. So first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is take your straw in your hand. Take the handle in your other hand. You're gonna take this, and you're just gonna place it right on top. And then push it in really hard to use all your strength to make sure it goes all the way in. Next, take our little shiny piece of laminated paper, right? And we're going to take our handle, we're going to push it through our shiny piece right through the center, okay? Now at this point, what works best for me at least to help put the pinwheel together as I set it down right on the table so that it's you know a little more balanced and easier to put together. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to take all the colors and go ahead and start with either color you want. You can start with green or red, but you're going to alternate and you're going to put this together so you can start with green. And just put it over the handle. And I recommend you just hold with your other hand the piece in the center and then you just start alternating. We started with green. Now we're going to go with red. Hold on a second here. See, this is where it gets a little complicated. And you may even need your parents' help, right? Or your loved one's help to come alongside. So now we've got two, green and red. And let's do green again. And we're going to do a red. And then green. And red. And green. And red. Almost there. Okay. Now, one of the keys is to not get frustrated, right? As you're putting that together, it can be a little hard. Now, we can see we've made our pinwheel. All you wanna do is take this little tip, you're gonna put it right in the center there, and you're just gonna press it down so that it locks the pinwheel in, just like that. Look at that. That is a good pinwheel right there. All right, now, this is the most important thing, right? The, the part we love the most. We blow on the pinwheel because we want to make sure it works. So let's, let's see how we did here, all right? That's pretty good. All right. Now what I would love, if you guys get the opportunity to, if you're ever at the chapel, bring your pinwheel, right? I want to see how yours works as well. So I hope this was really helpful for you guys and have a fantastic day, a fantastic night, uh, whatever time of day it is. And I hope to see you later. Bye.